Hello friends, bonjour mes amis. Welcome to channel Rays of Blade on YouTube and one welcome to my monthly review of the Maniology Manny by Me stamping kit. These come, um, these boxes come once a month. You can get the express kit or you can get the standard kit, the box, which is what I got this month. Uh, this is the review and um, unboxing of the box from August of 2020. You have about 11 more days to grab it. If you want to head over to maniology.com, um, I will have a link to uh, look at their program on the in the description field of this video. Uh, today, uh, nous faisons un picnic. We're going on a picnic, and we have two lovely picnicy plates and some polishes that will help us. Uh, there's a watermelon um, that they did specifically. I know that people have complained about a lot of pinks, but they specifically did these two colors. They they have a card with a uh, instructions, very good instructions on a watermelon manicure uh, in case you um, are in the mood to do that when you get your kit. And uh, it comes with, they always throw in one bonus item. This month it is a glass cuticle pusher. And uh, very important, they do say to store it in the tube, so don't throw that away. Um, if you, uh, this is a little, <laughs> a little late for me to tell you, but because um, I usually say so at the beginning. But if you enjoy this video, please like the video. I would love to hear your comments below about whether you enjoy the kit, whether you like anything that I did with my manicures, whether you want me to do something different or something new in the future. Tell me what you think, and I would love it if you subscribe, if you enjoyed the video as well. Um, I do a lot of reviews and uh, inspiration manis for this sort of thing. So uh, let's start with uh, the first plate, which is MXM037. We have um, some, some check patterns for a, like a picnic table or a picnic cloth. We've got some woven baskety patterns for the picnic baskets. And if you have gotten um, Maniology's uh, boxes for a while now, recently you got a uh, kind of a tan color. I don't remember which month that box came in, but there's a tan stamping color that along with the dark brown would be perfect for one of these um, woven basket textures. So also we have are, uh, again, I apologize for my ring light. I'm working on trying to get uh, my softbox uh, set up back, but I can't get it right now. So this is what we got. Um, we have this, this particular plate reminded me of with all of the little crumbly bits and the, the half eaten foods, etc. It reminded me of, um, I don't know if you have seen the animated Charlotte's Web from the late 1970s. That is, uh, Templeton the rat was uh, sent on, uh, was persuaded to go to the fair because of all the half-eaten food that he would find. So my inspiration, Manny, for this particular plate is a sample of what I imagine Templeton's dream would be. So we have the cheese and the apple core and the half-eaten chocolate chip cookie and the banana. And then I apologize, like I said, I have a, I've told you guys before, but if you're new to my videos, I have an autoimmune disorder and my skin is in a flare up right now. And then we have some grapes that he's dreaming of. And I used all of the crumbly bits as sort of like uh, galaxy stars and, uh, and meteors. So um, I hope you enjoy that one. That is for that plate and that inspiration, Manny. Um, if you, I, I, I do my uh, Galaxy Manny's like, um, I mean, I, I think Kelly, Marissa, and Simply Neological have done the best Galaxy Manny tutorials, especially Kelly, Marissa. Um, so if you, um, if you ask below, um, I will uh, look up that video for you and uh, 
and and tell you how I learned to do my uh, galaxy. Anyway, so that is that plate. We've also got another plate here, MXM038. These plates are exclusive to Manny by Me Club members, but once you are in the club, like if you're doing it for one month, you can skip or cancel any time. You can buy past plates if they're still available in past boxes. So anyway, we've got a honey bear and some a sub sandwich, and we've got a, a scene of a a, basically a picnic scene and then we've got the watermelon and this is the stamp that they use for the tutorial um, that's included we've got the probably the my favorite grass stamp that I have ever seen I was really happy with this one we've got a scenic um, setting here with the picnic blanket and the the river and the mountains or maybe it's a lake we don't quite know um, we've got the serviette and the plate We've got a glass of um, wine and the bottle, et cetera, et cetera. So here's a picnic basket with some wine and some probably cheese, I think, and a couple of glasses and a bicycle, guitar, kite, you just all, easel, all sorts of stuff. Okay, this, so this is a lot of fun too. Here is the Manny that I did for that one. Uh, I did, a, I did the scenery and I did a gradient that took the blue all the way down through the uh, light green at the bottom of the grass. Um, but the decal that I made, well, reverse stamping, I kept it on the stamper. Uh, the decal that I made uh, basically covers up most of the uh, gradient that I did, but I did do some um, sponging of some clouds in the background and I made the kite and here is the picnic blanket etc so that itself is a whole scene as a Manny I really like to do the landscape ones and then here is the grass stamp along with the picnic basket so that is the thumb for that one and that is it for the sample manis and the plates. Now I'm going to show you the swatches or just straight out of the bag, straight out of the box, how they, how they swatched for me. Uh, Maniology plates are always excellent quality. So no surprise, I didn't have any problems except for a smudge at the bottom. Here is plate 37. Here are the different picnic blanket kind of ideas. And then here are the baskets very very cool i love this super realistic look of these you can use them for many things i've i have specifically this one and this one i have looked for in other in other plates as uh, before but i haven't seen them done quite like this before i really like that i am sad that there's no bite out of the muffin no i'm kidding you can use that for more things now that there's not a bite out of it but here are the various things i i did leave the little crawly critters out of my galaxy manny because that was templeton's dream and he would have liked to eat the um, food all himself he wouldn't have wanted to sacrifice it to any little insects so there you go that is for 37 that's how that stamped right out of the bag i mean look at that i love that pair look at that detail there all right for 38 we've got the watermelon, we've got the grass, we've got all these little things in, in the picnic, little montage, not montage, I can't think of the word I'm looking for, so I'm not going to say it. We've got a guitar and a pie and a half-eaten watermelon, all sorts of stuff for that little stamp. Uh, I believe this is a crown of flowers, the sort of thing that you would have done as a kid when you were, you know, sitting in a field uh, picking clover flowers and waving them together here's a little handmade bouquet here is the landscape that i have on my left hand and then we've got you know a, a wine opener and all sorts of fun things bicycle a picnic basket that's full all sorts of things and they stamped great this was my fault so i went ahead and redid it so those are the swatches for this box. I hope that you enjoyed this video. 
I have a new video coming out in about three or four days. I'm gonna surprise you with what that is about because I'm working on a few different manis and I don't know exactly where I'm gonna go as far as what I'm gonna turn my video, um, what I'm gonna put in the video next. But I have lots of videos in my head cooking and I would love it if you would subscribe. If you had fun today with me, please like the video. And I, as I said, I'd love to hear your comments below. For information on how to grab this guy, my description box has everything you need. See you guys later, and I look forward to the next video with you. Bye. Guys, this is ridiculous. I'd forget my head if it weren't pre-installed. I just, uh, I was watching my video, getting ready to post it, and I realized that I hadn't shown you any of my swatches for these polishes that come with the box. So um, do please, I, I put in a note, but I hope you've stayed till the end to see what these polishes look like swatched. This is watermelon. And this particular polish on its own, quite opaque, lovely. One, that's one coat, obviously, because it's a stamping polish and they tend to be awesome like that. And then I have a half white and half black swatch stick. Not so great on the black, excellent on the white. And that is watermelon. So the next polish that comes with the box in August is rind. And that goes with the sample Manny that they show you how to do in that little postcard that I talked about earlier. So here is one coat of that nice and opaque. That's with a top coat over it. Uh, I'm going to use the heck out of this green. This is this is a great green for stamping. I've got I mean I've got a lot of emerald greens, Kelly greens, that kind of thing, but this is a, a nice green. Uh, as usual with these um, polishes that, that are darker, uh, it doesn't show up really well on the black, but on the white, it's beautiful. So there's that. And then since I was filming an extra little bit here, I, I was running a little long earlier, so I, I just pop. Came, it went right out of my head to do these. The, the polish I was talking about is uh, Latte that I, I think would go well with the darker brown with those basket textures. So that was in a previous box, but it should be available now. And since I was showing you guys a little, a few extra things, I wanted to show you guys the glass cuticle pusher that comes with the kit. It has one angled size side for pushing your, <laughs> it's clear so it, it's it's not being found by the camera I guess by the focus but anyway so the angled side is for pushing your cuticles and it says that the pointed side is for clearing away the detritus of skin that arises from your maintenance there so anyway so that is that that also comes with the box so that's my little sum up I've already done the outro about subscribing, liking, commenting, so I won't mention all that stuff again, except I just did. Um, but I look forward to seeing you guys in a few days with my next video, and apologies for the addendum. Bye!